Oh, hey, you're back. Tyler here with the Pyramid Insider. Today, I'm going to run down some of our holiday picks for the hottest guns of 2021. If you didn't know about these already, now you're going to. All right, so starting off our list here, we have the Umarex Gauntlet 2. Uh, obviously, this one came out to a lot of fanfare as the upgrade to the ever popular Gauntlet 1. Uh, real nice shooter, very, very powerful. A lot of nice upgrades over the original in this one. Definitely one you need to check out if you are in the market for an affordable PCP. I highly recommend it. Next up, we have the Benjamin Semi Auto Marauder. Now, this is the synthetic stock model. The Woodstock had been out for a little bit. 22 caliber regulated semi-auto that's the important one of course you've got all your classic marauder features shrouded barrel you know you've got your qd fill system here gauge on the underside of the gun there uh, but that semi-auto allows you to get quick follow-up shots and is a ton of fun next up on our list is the woodstock avenger now this came out early 2021 uh, very very popular a lot of people asked for that woodstock this gun is super adjustable. You have an adjustable regulator, adjustable hammer spring, side lever action, lovely gun, a little bit heavier than the original, uh, handles really nicely and shoots great too. Next up is the Gamo Swarm Fusion Gen 2. Now that Gen 2 refers to this new lower profile indexing system for the magazine, which allowed them to integrate some open sights on it, which is very nice. We've got an upgraded scope on it here, but you have a thumb hole stock. And again, you know, that 10X system, regardless of if it's the old style or this new Gen 2, gives you that quick, fast follow-up ability uh, that really makes this a ton of fun and a pleasure to shoot available in 177 and 22 caliber. Next up, we have the latest in the SIG line. This is the MCX Cane Break. Now, this is built off a similar system to their original MCXs and MPXs, uh, but obviously a much shorter system. The Cane Break is an integrally suppressed rifle that they make, uh, and to see it in air gun format is really, really cool. Obviously, semi-auto capable with their normal belt style mags. Uh, this is a great little tactical CO2 blaster. Uses an 88 gram cartridge right in the back there. Uh, this thing's going to be a great training tool, a lot of fun. They're usually pretty accurate, you know, come with the sights, everything that you need to get started, uh, especially good for those of you that are looking to do some training in the backyard. All right, next up, we have the Crossman A4P. Now, I know what you're thinking, Tyler, this is a BB pistol, not a rifle. You're supposed to be talking about hot rifles. Well, guys, I'm going to be honest with you. It's a pifle, okay? Pistol rifle. It does both blurs that line really nicely. This is a full auto BB blaster and a ton of fun built on that DPMS SBR kind of frame. Uh, you have a really short barrel on this and no butt stock, all right? So yeah, it's made to be shot kind of like this, but you could throw that into your shoulder, throw a red dot on it, and you're gonna have a ton of fun. 25 rounds, full auto, semi-auto, whatever you want, and it's got blowback. A great option for a backyard pointer. Next up is the Walther Rain. Now this came out earlier in 2021, 22 caliber and 25 caliber respectively. This is brought to us by Walther and Umarex, obviously, and their first kind of bullpup PCP entry. You've got a bottle hidden in the stock here, a very, very nice looking gun. One of my favorite things is actually this cocking lever right here. It's obviously positioned in a good ambidextrous spot for anyone to get to it without breaking position much, but it is also ambidextrous so you can flip it over to the left hand side they detail how to do that in the manual uh, overall a really sweet looking gun and shoots pretty darn well too available right now good choice if you're in the market for a bullpup and last but certainly not least is one i have been highly anticipating and that is the hot song factor rc now this is regulated and adjustable regulated so you have your regulator adjustment here. We have a hammer spring adjustment here. And if we flip it over, we have a transfer port adjustment. So this is gonna allow you to set it up however you want. And it uses those swing load magazines that we saw on the Blitz. So you're getting a ton of shots per magazine. 580 cc bottle this thing's going to offer a lot of shots per fill as well a nice side lever action and kind of that tactical ar style buttstock that is adjustable you have an ar style grip and a small picatinny four end rail here so you can mount your bipods and accessories things like that this should be an awesome shooter a little bit higher end price point for hot but offering a lot of features and a great 
great value. I'm really excited to get this one out and shooting. That's going to wrap us up here for our hot guns of 2021 holiday picks. Hope you enjoyed it. I've got to get back to work. I'll see you guys later.